I have spent 30 years at grassroots empowering women and youth through business and education. I truly believe that income is key in a poor household. My hope is that as we move from this set of Millennium Development Goals into the Sustainable Development Goals post-2015, we shall take cognizance of the fact that we have failed the women of this world. We can quote, sweet quote it in any other way, but that's a fact. We have, we have registered a lot of success, but we didn't achieve MDG 3 and 5. 3, gender equality and women's empowerment, and 5, maternal health. And so, I have always said for the past 10 years that we can only achieve those two if we have an integrated approach, a holistic approach, where we go into an area, we provide education, because when you, when you assist women go into business and make money, they gain respect, they stop having more children, but one positive major advantage is that the girls in that house would go to school. If they go to school, they don't get married early. And if they don't get married early, they don't die giving birth. My research has shown that those that are dying are between the ages of 19, 15 and 20. And uh, so uh, maternal health, HIV and AIDS. The fourth pillar for me is leadership. Push as many women as possible get into leadership, into public life. Because when they do, they focus more on issues that affect women and children. I am a living example. When I got into state, state house, first I made sure that women on merit are appointed to senior positions. For the first time we had a chief secretary that was a woman, a chief justice that was a woman, a solicitor general that was a woman, two deputy governors of the Reserve Bank, eight district commissioners that controlled money at local government level. It is important that women must be in leadership. And finally, that of rights. Rights is a cross-cutting pillar. Unless we go into an area and go into this household and support them in all those five areas, we shall never achieve even the sustainable development goals.